Hey everyone, Oliwin Gaming here, and welcome back to another video. And in today's video, I'm going to be building a £30 gaming PC and seeing how it holds up in Fortnite Battle Royale and a few other games. If you guys haven't already, please make sure to like and subscribe, turn on post notifications, and yeah, let's get into it. For the case in this build, I'm using a random case which I found in a skip. It is a nice purple colour, as you can see it opens there so it's pretty cool and uh, as I pulled that up it broke so um, yeah I can't get it back down but that's the case I'm using. For the graphics card I'm using an Nvidia GT440 which I picked up from a car boot sale for £3. It's a decent graphics card so that's why I'm using it in this build and I picked it up for really cheap so yeah. For the motherboard in this build, I'm using an Intel motherboard which I picked up from eBay for £15 and it was bundled with 4 gigs of RAM and an Intel Core 2 Quad Q9400 so yeah it was a pretty good deal. For the hard drive, I'm using a WD Blue which I picked up from CEX for £4. It is a 500 gigabyte version so quite a lot of storage. For the PSU, I'm using a Antec PSU 80 plus bronze 300 watt which I got from eBay for £8. 300 watts is plenty of power for this build because I'm not using a powerful graphics card or anything like that. If you are wondering where the CPU cooler is, I still need to order one of them so that will be in part 2 where I actually power on the PC and download the games and see how it holds up. Hopefully it works, I'm not sure if the parts actually work, I haven't tested them or anything so yeah. Right, now I'm going to be showing you me building the PC, so let's get into it. I think that would do it guys for this video, this is the build so far, how it looks, I think it turned out pretty nice, the cable management doesn't look too bad, so yeah that would do it, and make sure to like, subscribe, and yeah I'll see you in the next video.